it is the 15th of June and here we go with the news for the day starting off with BBC News UK on Twitter England and South Africa host secure series win with empathic Canterbury victory Tweets have been paid to renowned physicist Professor Stephen Hawking in Westminster Abbey Memorial Service Trump dossier offered Christopher Steele fights defamation case. World Cup 2018, Cristiano Ronaldo free kick falls Portugal level against Spain. Roller coaster derails in Florida, leaving riders dangling. Cristiano scores hat trick as Portugal and Spain draw free all. Mark Beaumont beats 127-year-old penny farthing record. No free all is full time, by the way. Troubled Pool Park Mini Railway contract terminated. Stairhill Hill Large Blaze tackled in Newport City Centre. Eiffel Tower perimeter built. Fence built on to stop terrorism. DUP leader leaders hand off friendship at Eid celebration in Belfast. Ruin end point, a 50 year old building safety problem. Here and more, government forces not attacking her day port. Michael Sancaster jail for biting mine in Sunderland. It's just getting scree scarier and scarier. Kind of Supreme Court rules LGBT rights trump religious freedom. Climate Commentary Council leader has had house shut up twice. Stephen Hawking's final message to message set to music composed by Van Jealous has been transmitted to a black hole. Great uncertainty over EU citizens' Brexit settlement scheme. Usain Bolt's 2012 Olympic Games shoes stolen in burglary. burglary. The Greatest Showman is longest reign number one soundtrack in 50 years. The Greatest Showman is in the film Greatest Showman and the soundtrack to that film. Inmate who wrote officer's name in board is jailed. Van Brat that shakes word and female remain in hospital. So now is all covering setback for mental health units reforms. Oxen Oxfam faces £16 million cuts after high tea sex scandal. Family relief not to face prison over dad's dignitas death. Finn's law, Tory MP derails bid for police dog law change. I'm lucky I tend to just think it's hilarious. It's Dr. Not Miss, insists historian. Michelle O'Neill says Northern Ireland parties cop out on abortion. Mother and daughter jail for terror plots. Bradford mother told to told by God to sacrifice son Elliot. Carwin Jones to be witness at Carl Sargent's inquest. New American Horror Story to be Murder House Coven crossover. Huge scrap metal fire shuts Coventry Airport. World's first medicine centre to be located located in Scotland. Crisis of Scotland funding system below expected standard. Men admit robbed armed robbery at police offices in home in Edinburgh. Columbia election the voters polarise ahead of running.
He was the archetypal charming rogue, and he stops and pays tribute to former EastEnders co star Leslie Grant for them, remarking on their magic chemistry. Record breaking crowd at Euro's, Europe's largest Eid celebration. Angry, frustrated, and disappointed Lib Dem MP, where Hub House says MP shouted shame after a Tory. MP blocked the oops skirting bill. Brad Brook Grove banned for making violent drill music. Made in head school asks parents to buy toilet roll. Moped teen highwaymen handed life sentences. Born to castle death, pair jail for three year, years. Upskirting offenders, quad face two year in jail under new law. Dark edges damaged by Storm Hector. Govia Thameslink Chief Executive Charles Horton resigns. We are scared, but we should not be because we're both ambassadors of peace. The beauty queens reunited despite the threat, death threats sparked by a selfie. Alpacas attacked by dogs need more legal protection. Oh, Parachute murder bid, Emily Siliers jailed for life. Brazen thief bags himself a Banksy. Stephen Hawking was going to run me over in his wheelchair for a Monty Python sketch. Professor Brian Cox remembers one of the last time he saw Stephen Hawking ahead of a service of Thanksgiving at Westminster Abbey. Rapist Dr. Kelly Jamar jailed for six years. Universal credit is too slow to roll out causes hardship and not value for money, watchdog says. Tesco says growth on track. As sales rise again. McDonald's to ditch plastic straws. Belvoir hunt attack. Princess Diana's sister vouches his four attackers. Attacker. Rare ancient writing found in medieval Cornish stone. Children in England consume twice as much sugar as recommended. Babies more likely to be born. At 4 a.m., study finds. As well as those people that were wasn't born at 4 a.m. instead of born at 2 a.m. Banks close. Banks close. 2,900 branches in three years. Says which? Dallas raises over universal credit rollout. Labour hand hold Lewisham East in by election. Rachel Sanders missing. Second missing botanist body identified. Boris Becker claims diplomatic immunity in bankruptcy case. Push a Muslim day letter suspects charged. David who is he is David Parnham, thirty five from Lincoln, charged by counter terrorism detectives. He will appear in court, accused of soliciting to murder and thirteen oral allegation allegations. Try to get out and open the door a little, a little bit. Lots of hot fix smoke came in. I couldn't get out. Antonio Ron Colato was a penultimate person to escape the Grenfell Tower. Tower.
It's fine, I've written my stage, but today side so and slips are struggling. Prince Charles meets Sin Fine, leader in leaders in court. Had that one. Moving on to BBC World Cup, World News, not World Cup. <laughs> Although the World Cup is likely to be mentioned, you know. U.S. child migrants 2,000 separated from families in six weeks. Michael Tower perimeter defense built to stop terrorism. UAE reinforcements in Eritrea to, ready to join Hodeida battle. World Cup 2018. Iran beat Morocco to win first World Cup finals tie in 20 years. George orders Manafort to be held in jail. When Lava meets the sea. About Kilway volcano recently, volcano re that erupted recently. When what looks like a steam is actually hydrochloric acid, mist called Lays. And it's like where the lava hits the sea, kind of thing. Trump kidding about every envy of Kim Jong Un's rule. Cristiano Ronaldo to accept jail term and £16.4 million pound fine in tax case. Dark Mofo, the provocative festival changing Tasmania's reputation. Florida Fraternity sued over sex image shared. Attorney General Jeff Sessions equips Bible to defend immigration policies. World Cup 2018 Uruguay scores late winner win uh, to beat Egypt 1 0. Russia proposes raising retirement age above life expectancy. Trump proposes 25% tariff on Chinese goods. Shudhat Bukhari, a man who epitomised the best of Kashmir. USS strike targets Pakistan Taliban chief in Afghanistan. Marathon threat clone anti terror police search flat. Google diversity figures show little change. Macron, Macron hosts Italian Prime Minister Conte after trading barbs over migrants. Czech President calls press conference for underwear burning. World Cup 2018 broadcaster Fox apologizes for Robbie Williams' gesture. Canadian clarinet player sues X for deleting his courtship offer. Cocaine, the captain, and the Frozen Mummies, Paolo Guerrero's World Cup journey. Shuchat Bukhari killing of Kashmir journalist shakes India. China vows fast response to US tariffs. India facing the worst water crisis in its history. Katie Von D, the makeup mogul, who is reunited, reunited anti vax around. AT&T completes its takeover of Time Warner. China's ride-hailing giant DD to launch in Australia. South Korea and the US discuss further of future of joint war games. Nicaragua protests the stage national strikes as clashes persist. Irvi dice. Dixon comedian killing comedians killing crewmates hunger in Australia. Yeah, when war you win calls for vital plots of the data to stay open. 
Portugal's wildfire that broke a community. The surprise place where he drives can spell trouble. Ignatius Sancho made me sure of who I am as a black Briton. Banksy print stolen from Toronto exhibit by Brazen Thief. Turkey election free dead in clash as people tension rises. Ex Walmart now shelter for migrant child migrants. That was a new for the day, and I'm gonna say bye for now. I'll see you some more tomorrow, depending on what time. And the uh, sister's birthday, no sister's birthday today. And I'll see you if.